kan enak nih ini Good afternoon, my dear brothers and sisters. Let us include in our prayers the intentions of Dominador Guzman Sr., Nancy Tan and family, Feli Kiambao and family, Salud Kuyiging Neighborhood Association, Peruel de la Peña, Santos Hildes, Alegre families, Lourdes Clem, Father Joel Baguna, SSP, Juan Gregorio Tumagan, Queenie Anna Tumagan, Charmaine Tumagan, Father Michael Albin Siquio, OSA, Dimler Ko, Dwight Ko, Daryl Ko, Dayon Ko, Medina Tapang, Leonila Generales, La Arne and Rain Mark, Perla Saldajeno, Juan Antonio Escultura, Anita Aban and Vian Juniel, Salve Ann Marie, and Briggs Joseph Iscano, Giuseppe Misote, Enrico Lucic, Manuel Akerman, Patrick Sizer, Teoduk Huyin, Laura Orsinigo, Monica Luzano, Marieta Gubi, Ophelia Dolete and family, Violeta Alonso and family, Liz Alba and family, Rowena Tuico, Joshua, Agapito family, Ed Antes Santos, Eric Angels, Lutgardo del Rosario, Elizabeth Habaradas, Rowell and Hazel Habaradas, Rino Jan and Fraulin Corpus, Henry and Marik C. C., Adrian Hendrix and Ia Henry C., Russell and Nina Ruela Pilhati, Angel Amora, Juni Amora and family, Rogelio Oyando, Mary Grace Fortaleza, Jacobo Fortaleza, Jesse Rex Chua, Joy and Rochelle Chua, Susing Savala, Andremi Savala, Lorraine Chua, Russell Kyle, Nigel Kate Pilhati, Ismailita Caballo, Camille Abweg, Chris Contreras, Con Concepcion Contreras, Marife Pamplina. For all suffering from COVID-19, for all medical frontliners, for the healing of Arnel Aquino, Gia Maika Lubiran, for the birthday of Vilma Tapang, Epitacio Sonko Jr., and Lisa Hernandez. <laughs> Eternal repose for the soul of the following Jose Chan, Choi Yuk Shu. Father Manny Ismael, Lutgardo and Erlinda, Angelico and Estilita, Alfonso and Blandina, 
Gregorio Raul Jr. and Corazon, Rosel Crisostomo, Romeo Divina, Rosemary Villegas, Consolacion and Lazaro Morales, Marthy Monet Velasco, Oliver Johannes Natividad, Jimmy Alba, Landring, Karin, Manny Almendras, Jesus, Olga, Ragsi, Maribel Alba, Father Sok Montialto, SSP, Manuel, Mario, Nelson Dolete, Jeffrey Dolete, Felisa Nuay, Vicente Nuay, Victor Villanueva, Orlando Villanueva, Albert Guidote, Rhino Paguntalan, Ryan Gamba, Wincislao Tarcolas, Innocencia Tarcolas, Vidal Tarcolas, Francisco and Amanda Ferrando, Carmelo Africa Jr., Loreto Villanueva, Edison and Rowena Sunco, Rick and Ricardo Jr., Romero, Vicente Rindal Sr., Joshua Mondihar, Neri Marbella, Felicitas Marbella, Fernando Marbella, Antonio Toledo, Jesus Toledo, Alberto Toledo, Cirilo Santiago, Raul Miranda, Anaceto Toledo, Lodigaria Toledo, Edwin Viñas, Leonora Calixto, Kelvin Barinikea, Alberto Rapisa, Jaime Rapisa, Alfred Rapisa, Bador Rapisa, Bodoy Rapisa, Angel Ann Arma, Mamerto Lumuardo, Felisa Lumuardo, Malu Binisano, Eusebio Morales, Eduarda Morales, Ninita Morales, Ramon Morales, Norberto Morales, Maria Socorro, Marcelo, Lucila, Beato Sr., Valeriana, Alberto Zapanta, Mark Asierto, Edison Ablau, Eduardo Sim, for the soul of all unborn children, for the lost, forgotten, and abandoned souls, for all who died of COVID-19, and for all souls in purgatory. In 
love we sing, eternal King, O oh Master adored. Good afternoon, my dear brothers and sisters. Let us now pray the Perpetual Novena to Mother Dolorosa de la Pieta. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Jesus, Divine Master, we thank and bless you for giving us from your Holy Cross, your Mother Mary, as our Mother and Queen. You gave her immaculate and sorrowful heart, much compassion, and immense power. May all know and love her. Like you, O Jesus, we place ourselves in her hands. Amen. Amen. We now honor Mary, Mother Dolorosa de la Pieta, in her sorrows she offered with Jesus her total yes, totus tuus, for our salvation. And we will recite. Holy Mother, pierce me through, in my heart each wound renew, of my Savior crucified. At the cross, your station keeping, you stood as mournful mother weeping, close to Jesus to the last. Oh, that silent, ceaseless morning, Oh, those dim eyes never turning from your wondrous suffering son. Bruised, derided, cursed, defiled, you beheld your tender child, now with bloody scourges rent. Together, touch, touch my, my spirit, spirit from, above, from above, make, make my, my soul, soul to glow and, and melt with the love of Christ, Christ my Lord. Lord. Salutation. Mater Dolorosa de la Pieta, your mother of Jesus and our mother. You carried Jesus from womb to tomb, carry us to church and all humanity, wounded by sin and division. As the body of Christ, you are the new Eve, the mother of all the living. O courageous Virgin Mother, gather us on your lap. Open for us the rich treasures of blessings that flow from the passion, death, and resurrection of your beloved Jesus. Hail, revocation of Adam's fall. Hail, redemption of the weeping Eve. Hail, for you are the throne of the King. Hail, for you bear, who bears all things. Hail, star heralding the sun. Hail, heavenly ladder, by which God has come down. Hail, bridge, by which those of earth are born to heaven. Hail, Hail for, for you, bear, bear, the loving the bear, bear of life. Hail, Hail middle for land yielding a rich harvest of mercy. Hail, Hail, acceptable incense, cloud of, of intercession. intercession. Hail, O mortal covenant, covenant with God. God. Hail, sheepfold for rational sheep. Hail, opener of celestial portals. Hail, O solid foundation of faith. Hail, O shining pattern of grace. Hail, Hail daybreak day, of the, the mystical, mystical day. day. Hail, Hail, O you who have cast out the inhuman tyrant of all. Hail, Hail, O you who deliver from the fire of passions. passions. 
Hail, Hail gladness of all generations. Hail, O three of richly splendid fruit, which sustains believers. Hail, O you, who are the birth giver of the captive's redeemer. Hail, mediatrix before the righteous judge. Hail, mercy for all those who have sinned. Hail, most excellent tabernacle of him, who is adored by the seraphim. Hail, O you, through whom paradise is opened. Together. Hail, Hail cause of light, light to the corrupter of souls. Hail, Hail distributor of God's, God's benevolence. Hail, unshakable tower of the church. Hail, O you, through whom our victories are won. We will now pray the chaplet of the seven sorrows of the Blessed Virgin Mother. Mater Dolorosa de la Pieta, Mother of Jesus in the power of the Holy Spirit, you accompanied him in his earthly life and mission. Mother of the body of Christ, in all our earthly journeys, take us under the mantle of your protection. The first sorrow, Mary with Joseph presents Jesus at the temple. Intentions, the newlyweds, for the newborn children, for mothers and for fathers. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for <coughs> us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The second sorrow. Mary with Joseph journeys with Jesus in haste to Egypt. Intentions for migrants, OFWs, travelers, and the homeless. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. The third sorrow. Mary with Joseph looks for the 12-year-old Jesus at the Jerusalem temple. Intentions for educators, broken and separated families, persons in difficulty, those who are lost, those struggling with various addictions. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, <laughs> pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The fourth sorrow. Mary meets and accompanies Jesus in the way of the cross. The intentions, the sick, the seniors and elderly, persons with disability. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The fifth sorrow. Mary stands by the cross of Jesus. Intentions. Students for caregivers and health workers. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The sixth sorrow. Mary cradles the lifeless body of our Lord Jesus, the intention, the terminally ill, the dying, and all the deceased, those who mourn, and those who care for the dead. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and the hour of our death. Amen. The Seventh Sorrow Mary sees a Jesus buried in a tomb. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Mother of sorrow, Mother Dolorosa de la Pieta, 
through the soul-piercing martyrdom you endured at the foot of the cross, assist us, children of sorrows, so that we may be worthy to pass from our stormy lives into paradise. Obtain hope and peace for all. Let us now mention our personal novena intentions. From sudden and unprovided death, deliver us, O Lord. From all the snares of the devil, deliver us, O Lord. From everlasting death, deliver us, O Lord. Concluding prayer, entrustment to Mother Dolorosa de la Pieta, together, Immaculate and Sorrowful Virgin Mary, Mother Dolorosa de la Pieta, we entrust ourselves and our dear ones to your maternal care, Mother of Mercy, comfort you of the afflicted, and help of all Christians. Turn your merciful eyes and incline your ears to us in all our public and private calamities. Aid us in our spiritual and temporal necessities. Deliver us from all evil, especially from sin, which is the greatest evil that Jesus conquered by his cross and resurrection. Obtain for us from your Son, Jesus, all blessings beneficial for our soul and body. Mother Mary, with the joys that spring from the resurrection of your Son, Jesus, Make us victorious against spiritual contagion and bodily epidemics, against countless miseries and misfortunes. Make us defeat Satan and his works that bring sin and death. O Mother of the Body of Christ, obtain peace and freedom for the Church, help and comfort for the Pope, the Bishop and the clergy, success and protection for Christian leaders, Courage and strength in the truth for all who work in the ever creative and evolving means of communications. Together, take into your mantle of protection the holy souls in purgatory, all sinners who struggle to renew their lives. Receive us, dear Mother, in your loving arms, that we may live virtuously, die in holiness and so attain everything, everlasting happiness with your risen Jesus in heaven. Amen. Amen. Mater Dolorosa de la Pieta, lead us to your greatest joy after all your sorrows. Jesus risen, to whom all glory, honor, and power belong forever and ever. Together, O Queen of Heaven, be joyful. Alleluia. For he whom you were worthy to bear, alleluia, has risen as he promised, alleluia. Pray for us to the Father, alleluia. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Good evening, my dear brothers and sisters. Good evening, Father. For this evening's Novena Mass, our second uh, evening uh, Novena Mass, we acknowledge our sponsors for... The Mass, uh, R.G. Landoy and Associates on their 35th anniversary of foundation. For the 36th wedding anniversary of Romulus and Susan Landoy. For Connie Contreras for her Thanksgiving. And for all those who have been sending their help for the parish. So, brothers and sisters, to prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries, let us now call to mind our sins. I confess to Almighty, Almighty God, God and to you, my brothers, my brothers and, and sisters, sisters, that I have, have greatly sinned in my thoughts, in my words, in what I have done, and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my, my most, most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask, Blessed Mary, ever virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. O God, who in each pilgrim church throughout the world make visible the one holy Catholic and apostolic church, graciously grant that your faithful may be so united to their shepherd and gathered together in the Holy Spirit through the Gospel and the Eucharist, as to worthily embody the universality of your people and become a sign and instrument in the world for the presence of Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the book of Genesis. Abram was very rich in livestock, silver and gold. Lot, who went with Abram, also had flocks and herds and tents, so that the land could not support them if they stayed together. Their possessions were so great that they could not dwell together. There were quarrels between the herdsmen of Abram's livestock and those of Lot's. At this time, the Canaanites and the Berezites were occupying the land. So Abram said to Lot, Let there be no strife between you and me, or between your herdsmen and mine. 
for we are kinsmen. Is not the whole land at your disposal? Please separate from me. If you prefer the left, I will go to the right. If you prefer the right, I will go to the left. Lord, look about and so how well watered the whole Jordan plain was as far as Zor, like the Lord's own garden or like Egypt. This was before the Lord had destroyed Sodom and Gomorrah. Lot, therefore, chose for himself the whole Jordan plain and set out eastward. Thus, they separated from each other. Abram stayed in the land of Canaan, while Lot settled among the cities of the plain, pitching his tents near Sodom. Now the inhabitants of Sodom were very wicked in the sins they committed against the Lord. After Lot had left, the Lord said to Abram, Look about you, and from where you are, gaze to the north and south, east and west, all the land that you see, I will give to you and your descendants forever. I will make your descendants like the dust of the earth. If anyone could count the dust of the earth, your descendants too might be counted. Set forth and walk about in the land through its length and breadth, for to you I will give it. Abram moved his tents and went on to settle near the terebinth of Mamre, which is at Hebron. There were built an altar to the Lord. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. He who does justice will live in the presence of the Lord. He who does justice will live in the presence of the Lord. He who walks blamelessly and does justice, who thinks the truth in his heart and slanders not with his tongue. He who does justice will live in the presence of the Lord. Who harms not his fellow man, nor takes up a reproach against his neighbor, by whom the reprobate is despised, while he honors those who fear the Lord. He who does justice will live in the presence of the Lord. Who lends not his money at usury, and accepts no bribe against the innocent. He who does these things shall never be disturbed. He who does justice will live in the presence of the Lord. Please all stand. Alleluia, alleluia. I am the light of the world, says the Lord. Whoever follows me will have the light of life. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel. According to Matthew, glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, Do not give what is holy to dogs or throw your pearls before swine, lest they trample them underfoot and turn and tear you to pieces. Do to others whatever you would have them do to you. This is the law and the prophets. Enter through the narrow gate, for the gate is wide and the road broad that leads to destruction, and those who enter through it are many. How narrow the gate and constricted the road that leads to life, and those who find it 
are few. Sisters and brothers, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Magandang gabi po muli, mga kapatid. Kani-kanina lang po ay natanggap na namin ang balita ng pagdating mula kapis ng ating bagong uh, iluluklok na uh, arsibispo ng uh, Archdiocese of Manila, si Jose Cardinal Advincula, na sa darating na 24, so two days from now. At uh, sa bagay na yan, ay talaga namang pinaghahandaan ng buong Archdiocese. Pero hindi lang po ng buong Archdiocese, no? Marami talaga ang excited <laughs> dahil nga uh, sa pag-alis ni Cardinal Tagle na kung saan ang naging administrador naman ay si Bishop Broderick Pabilio, talagang bulong-bulungan hindi lang dito sa Maynila, kundi kung saan-saan sa buong Pilipinas, sino ang papalit no? sa, sa pamumuno ng Archdiocese of Manila. Remember, Archdi the Archdiocese of Manila is the mother, no? Archdiocese for the whole Philippines. Kung napanood niyo po kahapon, ang catechetical material, kung paano lumago, ang Archdiocese of Manila, no, makikita nyo gahano kalaga ang naging bahagi ng uh, Archdiocese of Manila sa paglaki ng simbahan sa ating bansa. So kung nakita nyo noon, ang original na parokya natin o Archdiocese natin ay nandun pa sa Mexico. No? At ang ating Archdiocese of Manila ay isang sufragan Sufragan in relation sa Metropolitan, which is in Mexico, no? Until na creation na naging Metropolitan Archdiocese at naging isang malaking diocese siya. Pagkatapos, hinati ng nagkaroon ng tatlong hati ng mga sufragan. Just remember the word sufragan, no? Na mga dioceses ng Nueva Cáceres sa Bicol, Nueva Segovia sa Ilocos, at sa Cebu. So yan po ang mga unang dioceses dito sa ating bansa. Ang Metropolitan ay ang Manila, at ang Suffragans ay ang sa Ilocos, sa Naga, at ang nasa Cebu. Pagkatapos po niyan, of course, yung kat katikisis natin, binanggit na yung pag dami ng mga archdiocese. Kung makikita nyo, gaano karami ang bilang ng mga pari dito sa archdiocese sa Manila na sa 270 plus diocese and priests. Ibig sabihin, galing mismo sa Maynila, no? sa archdiocese. Pero ang religious priests, kasama ko kaming taga St. Paul, kami ho ay mga nasa 300 plus religious priests. At ang mga religious sisters naman po, kung hindi ako nagkakamali, nasa 800 po ba? With the religious brothers, numbering around 300 plus o 200 plus. Sa dami po niyan, yan po ang mga katulong ang nakakasama ng Arsubispo ng Maynila. Yan po ang mga kaagapay niya sa pagpapalago, sa pananampalataya para sa buong kinasasakupan ng Archdiocese of Manila. Anyway, I'm sharing all this just to ready ourselves. No? How important itong pagluluklok sa bagong halal nating uh, Cardinal Advincula bilang siyang ikatatlumput tatlong uh, Archbishop ng Manila. Oh, so, ngayon po ay nasa ikawalong araw tayo ng novena ng paghahanda sa sandaling iyon para sa darating na 24. 
Pero sa araw rin pong ito, ay atin namang ginugunitang ikalawang araw ng novenaryo naman para kay St. Paul the Apostle. Ang aming patron no, bilang kasapi ng Society of St. Paul. Kaya nga po tayo merong imahe ni St. Paul dito. Nandun po si St. Paul no, nasa kaliwa po. Itong nasa kanan ay si San Jose. Sapagkat ang barangay ho natin dito sa parokya ay dati yung barangay San Jose. I guess hanggang ngayon, para sa mga matatanda, they still remember na ito ay barangay San Jose. Pero ang biruan nga namin, ang usapan namin sa taas, baka magkapalit yung dalawa na yan. No, pupunta si St. Joseph doon, si St. Paul dito. No, bakit? Kasi we remember St. Paul as a preacher, no? as an apostle, as a writer, dapat nasa side siya ng ambo na ng, uh, ng uh, itong pwestong aking kinatatayuan. So, ganun raw yun. But anyway, those are traditions, those are things that we are still uh, considering. So, anytime kapag inayos po ang ating simbahan, talagang magbabago ho. No? And we are hoping na talaga namang gaganda. No, sa tulong ng maraming tao. Brothers and sisters, when I was reflecting the gospel reading today, going back to our readings, in the gospel, kung pampansin ninyo, may tatlong bahagi. Hindi naman sa kaur bahagi, pero tatlong mga puntong idinidiin. No? Ang unang bahagi, binanggit sa atin dito, do not give what is holy to dogs. No? Huwag mo ibigay sa mga aso kung ano ang banal o ang mga perlas doon sa mga babuyan dahil totoo hindi nila nakikita ang halaga ng mga bagay na yan ikaw lang ang nakakaalam kung ano ang mga banal na bagay na hindi dapat sinasayang sa pangalawa naman sinasabi sa ating ibanghelyo sabi dito do to others whatever you would have them do to you. Of course, we also know this as the golden rule. No, isang gabay para sa pamumuhay upang mabuhay ng matuwid, ng tama, at nararapat, at naaayon. No? At sa huling bahagi naman ng Ibanghelyo, na kung saan binanggit ng Panginoon, ang sabi niyang, enter through the narrow gate, for the gate is wide and the road broad that leads to destruction yet how narrow the gate and constricted the road that leads to life may dalawang daan tayong tatahakin sa buhay ang makipot na naghahatid sa atin sa buhay na makabuluhan at ang daang maluwag na kung saan hinahatid tayo sa pagkawala ano ang maaaring madampot natin sa tatlong turo ng Panginoon kung hahabihin natin lahat o kung lahat ay pagdudugtong dugtong pagsasama natin? Remember po ang Gospels, ang pagkakasulat po niyan, this were written, though sabi nga, maybe chronologically, but also this writings are also considered coming from the memory of the apostles, the memory of the early Christian church. So kung anong natatandaan nila sa turo ng mga apostol, sa turo ng ating Panginoon, sa turo ng mga sinaunang alagad ni Jesus, yun ang isinusulat nila. Kaya kung papansin ninyo, parang very random, very spontaneous, ika nga. Parang, oh, parang wala naman atang connection to. But if you did see clearly, mayroon ang lahat niyan. Alam niyo, when I was reflecting on this, I would go back to my experience of hearing confession among those na nakalimot na kung paano gumawa ng maayos na kumpisan. Minsan may lalapit talaga at magsasabi, Father, gusto ko mangumpisal pero napakatagal na. Father, paano ba mangumpisal? No? Paano ba mangumpisal? So, 
you have to give an instruction na madali niya rin maunawaan, masusundan. Usually, ang ginagawa lang, tatlong bagay, kung ano man ang ikukumpisal mo. Ano ang nagawa mong kasalanan that you know, you have offended God. Secondly, anong kasalanan na alam mo, you have offended somebody, someone. And lastly, ano yung kasalanan mo na maaring masabi mong pagpapabaya sa sarili mo. Tatlong bagay, ang titignan mong relationships. Ang relationship mo sa Diyos, ang relationship mo sa iyong kapwa, at ang pagpapahalaga mo sa sarili mo. Diyan mo simula na ang kumpisal mo. Now, ito ang gospel reading natin would be a good uh, say, measurement of how are we to confront our sins. How are we to acknowledge our sins? First, what are the sacred things, the holy things, ang mga banal na bagay na nakakaligtaan nating kilalanin na totoong banal para sa atin? Ang obligasyon natin tuwing linggo na magsimba. Ang paglapit natin sa kumpisalan, at least one a year, once a year. Ang paghahanda ng sarili bago tumanggap ng komunyon. Ang pananalangin kahit papano sa umaga at sa gabi. Sa pagsisimula ng araw at sa pagtatapos ng araw. Those are sacred practices, holy practices na sana huwag masayang. And do natin i-measure rin our failure to do these things. Secondly, the golden rule, which is so obvious for all of us. Kung ano ang pagkukulang mo sa iyong kapwa, no? banggitin mo. Kung ano ang mga pagmamalabis natin sa ating kapwa, no? aminin natin at tingin ng kapatawaran. Magandang gabay ang golden rule. At ang pangatlo, ang binabanggit ng Panginoon, ang makitid na daan at ang maluwag na daan tungo sa kasiraan o yung makitid na daan na gahatid sa buhay na makabuluhan. Anong daan ba ang tinatahak natin sa mga sandaling ito? May mga pagkakataon bang napabayaan na natin ang mga sarili nating krus? Tinalikuran na natin ang ating mga pasanin na alam nating magiging gabay sa ating pagpapakabanal, sa ating pagpapakumbaba. Pagpapakumbaba. Our emptying. For indeed, if we have to follow someone, no one else but the Lord who emptied himself and followed and follow the way of the cross, the way of suffering, which is truly a way of holiness. As we continue in this Mass, brothers and sisters, we ask the Lord na sa tatlong bagay na ito na maring masilip natin, ano na ba ang lagay ko ngayon sa buhay? How is my relationship with God? How is my relationship with my brothers and sisters? And how do I take care of myself towards the path of holiness, towards the path of God? May God bless each and every one of us. Amen. Prayers of the faithful. Merciful and compassionate Father, in the name of Jesus who rose victorious from sin and death, we come to you in this time of the COVID-19 virus that has disturbed and even claimed lives. With humility and faith, we all pray, Lord, we trust in you. Lord, we trust in you. That Pope Francis, the bishops, the clergy and the religious, 
will be constant teachers and examples of gospel faith, hope, and love, that they witness the great power of the Divine Spirit, even as they encourage practical and social actions to alleviate the effects of the contagion, we pray. Lord, we trust in you. That medical and scientific researchers, pharmaceuticals, doctors, hospital and healthcare administrators be guided by heartfelt human solidarity and by their conscience in their task to find cures for the infected and ways to stop the transmission of the virus with vaccines and with every possible means available, we pray. Lord, we trust in you that government officials and agencies in charge of general welfare and of peace and order be motivated by true love of all, that they always give this interested service due to all, especially for the poor who are greatly disadvantaged, we pray. Lord, we trust in you that the sick and their families Find the value of family love that supports and heals and the importance of sincere continuing prayer that bears fruit not just in healing but in the conversion of hearts and minds, we pray. Lord, we trust in you that owners of business, goods and services, and economic managers balance their money-making with greater efforts to help their community, we pray. Lord, we trust in you. That health frontliners, peace and order frontliners, and other basic service frontliners be sustained in their health, in their family needs, and in their moral and spiritual strength, we pray. Lord, we trust in you that the dead find eternal rest, that their grieving families find solace in prayer and in loving and caring for one another, we pray. Lord, we trust in you. That those who are healthy may not just be indifferent, but be constant in interceding for all and in sharing their time, talent, and treasure to sustain community and church services, we pray. Lord, we trust in you for our personal and community concerns. We pray. Lord, Lord we, we trust, trust in you. Father, we know nothing is impossible with you. In the name of Jesus and through the prayers of the Blessed Mother Mary and Saint Joseph, stop this pandemic and dissolve this virus. Lead us to your path of healing, cure, conversion, and holiness. Glorify your name forever and ever. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for its your goodness, we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and the work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for its your goodness, we have received the wine we offer you, Fruit of the vine and work of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Lord God, we ask you to receive us with peace and sacrifice. We offer you with humble and contrite hearts. Lord God. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands 
for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Celebrating the memorial of your son's boundless love, we humbly beseech you, O Lord, that through the ministry of your church, the fruits of his saving work, may advance the salvation of all the world. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For when your children were scattered afar by sin, through the blood of your Son, and the power of the Spirit, you gather them again to yourself, that a people formed as one by the unity of the Trinity, may the body of Christ and the temple of the Holy Spirit, might to the praise of your manifold wisdom, be manifest as the church. And so in company with the choirs of angels, we praise you and with joy we now proclaim. Holy, 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 holy Lord, Lord, God, God of hosts, hosts. Heaven and, Heaven and earth, earth are, are full, full of your of glory. Your glory. Hosanna, Hosanna in the, in the highest. highest. Blessed, Blessed is he who comes in the name, in the name of, the of the Lord. Hosanna, Hosanna in, the in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, this gifts we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed, and entered willingly into his passion. He took bread and giving thanks broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. When we eat this bread and drink, drink this cup, cup we, we proclaim your, your death, O Lord, Lord until, until you, you come, come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Lord, remember your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, Broderick, our Bishop Administrator, and Cardinal Jose Advincula, our Bishop-elect, and all the clergy, remember also our brothers and sisters, most especially the deceased members of our own families and all who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, the Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, St. Paul, Blessed Timothy Jacardo, Blessed James Alberione, Blessed Elena Guerra, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merry to be co-heirs to eternal life, and we praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, and with him, and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. As the community gathered in prayer and love, let us now pray the prayer Jesus himself taught us. Our, Our Father, who art, who art in, in heaven, heaven Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, 
as, as we forgive, forgive those, those who trespass, who trespass against, against us. us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope in the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace, I live you, my peace, I give you. Lord, look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant our peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you, brothers and sisters. Peace be with you. Peace be with you, Father. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. May this be in love, Lord Jesus Christ, may turn your life to us who receive it. May the receiving your body and blood, Lord Jesus Christ, not bring me to judgment and condemnation, but to your loving mercy be for me protection in, in mind and body and a healing remedy. Behold, Jesus, our healing and our deliverance, the Lamb of God that takes away the sins of the world. Blessed is called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, Lord I am not, not worthy, worthy that you should enter under, under my roof, but, but only say the word, the word and my, my soul, soul shall, be. shall be here. With the body and blood of Christ, bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Amen. Brothers and sisters, the body of Christ. Amen. Communion Antiphone The eyes of all look to you, Lord, and you give them their food in due season. Spiritual Communion my Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen.
Let us pray. In this your church, O Lord, may integrity of faith, holiness of life, fraternal charity, and pure religion flourish and abide until the end. And as you do not fail to feed her with the body of your Son and with your word, so also never cease, we pray, to guide her under your protection, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Let us now pray the second day of our Novena prayer to St. Paul the Apostle. Please kneel together. I bless you, Jesus, for having elected the Apostle Paul as a model and preacher of holy virginity. And you, St. Paul, my dear father, guard my mind, my, my heart, heart, and my, and my senses, senses, in, in order, order that, that I may know, love, and serve, and serve only Jesus, Jesus and, and employ all, all my energies for, for his, his glory. In silence, let us mention our Novena intentions. St. Paul the Apostle, pray for us. Let us now also pray for the gratitude for the gift of our new Archbishop. Together, Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ good, good Shepherd, Shepherd and High, and High Priest, Priest, we, we praise, praise you and offer, and offer you our sincere gratitude, gratitude for calling Cardinal Jose Advincula to serve, to serve us, as our, our Archbishop. Archbishop. May, May he lead us as a loving, as a loving shepherd, shepherd who cares, who cares for his flock and seeks out the lost sheep. sheep. May, May he be for us a gentle, a gentle and listening, and listening father, father, a faithful, a faithful teacher, teacher and a steward, steward of your, of your sacred, sacred mysteries. mysteries. Grant him health, strength, strength and, and wisdom, wisdom. Strengthen the bonds of unity among, among us, your priests and faithful, in our, our archdiocese, so that we may serve you as one, one body. Purify, purify us and sustain, and sustain us in charity, for your love for us never, never fails. Grant, Grant that the faithful of our local church may boldly, boldly answer your call for the mission. You who live and reign with the, the Father and the Holy Spirit, Spirit God, God forever and ever. Amen. I will now impart the blessing with the Blessed Sacrament. Let us be seated for a while as we watch the VG material prepared for us by the Archdiocese in preparation for the installation of our new Archbishop.
ang Pastoral and Administrative Organization ng Archdiocese of Manila. Ang Diocesan Kurye ng Archdiocese of Manila ay binubuo ng Arsobispo, Auxiliary Bishop, Vicars General, Judicial Vicars, at Episcopal Vicars. Sila rin ang tumatayong College of Consultors na tumutulong sa Arsobispo upang magpasya sa mga masiselang bagay tungkol sa usapin ng Archdiocese. Ang Pastoral Secretariat ng Roman Catholic ng Archdiocese of Manila ay merong tanggapan sa 121 Arsobispado Street, Intramuros, Manila. Ito ay binubuo ng iba't ibang tanggapan, katulad ng Chancery, Human Resource Development, Treasury and Accounting, Auditing, Tribunal, Engineering and General Services, Information Technology, Research and Properties. Ang Archdiocese of Manila ay binubuo ng iba't ibang komisyon na gumagalaw ayon sa kanilang layunin. Ito ay ang mga sumusunod. Commission on Liturgy, Commission on Social Services and Development, Commission on Extraordinary Phenomena, Commission on Mission, Commission on Migrants and Itinerant People, Commission on Social Communications, Commission on Family and Life, Commission on Youth, and Commission on Church and Cultural Heritage. Para sa mga pari at magpapari, ang Manila Archdiocese Seminary System Foundation Incorporated na binubuo ng iba't ibang seminary na may kanya-kanyang layunin ng paghubog, katulad ng Our Lady of Guadalupe Minor Seminary, San Carlos Seminary, Holy Apostle Senior Seminary, Lorenzo Mission Institute, at ang Redemptorist Mater Missionary Seminary. Ang Archdiocesan Vocation Office ay may tungkulin na mag-recruit ng mga bukasyon para sa pagpapari. Ang Archdiocese ay meron ding permanent formation house for the clergy, kagaya ng bahay pari at Cardinal Sin Welcome Home. Ang Commission on Formation of the Laity and Christian Communities ay binubuo naman ng iba't ibang tanggapan na nangangalaga sa paghubog ng mga laiko. Ito ay ang Ministry on BEC Formation and Promotion at ang Ministry on Biblical Apostolate. Ang Commission on Catechesis and Catholic Education ay binubuo naman ng Catechetical Foundation of the Archdiocese of Manila at Institute of Catechetics of the Archdiocese of Manila na nangangalaga sa mga katikista at ng ARCAM Education System or ARCAM ES na nangangalaga ng iba't ibang parochial school ng Archdiocese. Ang Archdiocese ng Manila ay meron ding mga repeat houses and formation center na ginagamit sa iba't ibang paghubog ng mga parokyano nito, kagaya ng St. Joseph Retreat House at ang San Lorenzo Ruiz Lay Formation Center. Ito ay nagmamayari at namamahala din ng mga sumusunod na institusyon na matatagpuan sa labas ng teritoryo nito. Mount Peace Retreat House sa Baguio City, St. Michael Retreat House sa Antipolo City, Rizal, DZRV, Radyo Veritas sa Barangay Philam, Quezon City, Ed sa Shrine or the Shrine of Mary, Queen of Peace sa Barangay Ugong Norte, Quezon City, at Redemptorist Mater Missionary Seminary sa Paranaque. Magsitayo na pong lahat. Naigawad na po ang pagbabasbas. Go in the peace and love of Christ. Thanks, Thanks be, be to God. God. Good evening po. Mula sa parokya ng Our Lady of Sorrows, F.B. Harrison, Pasay City. Mula sa mga pari ng Society of St. Paul na naka-assign sa parokya, 
mula sa Sambuhay TV Unit ng Our Lady of Soros Paris. Salamat po. God bless you. Mater Dolorosa de la Pieta cares for you. Nais kong maging bahagi ng isang adhikain At maging isa sa gawaing makadyosa at masaya Paglilingkod sa Diyos at kapwa Sa ikalawang parokya ng Pasay Kaisa ng Birheng Maria Our Lady of Sorrows Tara nga Viva Mater Dolorosa, Virgo de la Pieta. Viva Mater Dolorosa, de la Pieta. Ora pro nobis sa OLS. Ituloy ang saya sa hirapan at pandemia. Pagpapanatigay ay makakamtan. Kapit lang sa Diyos ng lubusan. Viva Mater Dolorosa, Virgo de la Pieta. Viva Mater Dolorosa, de la Pieta. Ora pro nobis sa Our Lady of Sorrows. Ituloy ang saya sa habang panahon. Kasama si Maria ang mahal na nikina. Salamat po, O Diyos, Ama, sa pagpapala mong lubos. Sa krus ni Kristo Jesus, na iyong anak kami tinubos. Sa patubay ng Espiritu, panag sa aming buhay. At kain ang Maria, ang bagong Eva na mapagkalina. Viva ang Pater Dolorosa, Virgo de la Pieta. Viva ang Pater Dolorosa, de la Pieta. Ora pro nobis sa Our Lady of Sorrows. Ituloy ang saya sa habang panahon. Kasama si Maria ang mahal 